Hello and welcome back to Ninja Manor. I've arrived back after Christmas to see that I owe nine and a half grand in bills. Luckily just in The Sims, not in real life. I wouldn't spend that much on Christmas. But that's ridiculous. Oh my god, this is going to financially destroy us. This is pushing us down to 14,000 in the bank. We can pay one more set of bills after this and then that's it. We'll be out of money. This is pretty disastrous. Um... Okay, I don't want us to go bankrupt, but it seems kind of unavoidable. I thought I was safe at this stage of a legacy challenge. A few generations in, you know, we've got a few jobs going. No, no, you're, you're not safe at all anymore. They've just made this game so much harder. I like it. I really like that as um, a thing. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's almost Connor the Third's birthday. Oh, he's about to become an elder. Oh, no. He's only career level eight. Oh, we have to get him up two more levels. And he's a long way off a promotion. Um, he needs to improve his charisma skill. And he's got work. And not for another three days. Okay, he's going to probably be an old man the next time he shows up at work. He's going to be like his uh, great... No, like his grandfather before him. And he's going to die at career level nine. I just know it. Um... Connor the fourth, she's getting re-energized. Working eight hours and she's like blasting off into space. Uh, Christmas is over, so I should probably change them all out of their Christmas jumpers. But I suppose it's still technically within the 12 days of Christmas, so I'm going to leave it for now. Um, when do they end? They start on like December 25th, of course, and end on January something. I don't know, 6th? That sounds about right. Um, so I'll just... I guess I'll leave the Sims dressed up for this session and maybe change them next time. Which might mean we have another Christmas ghost running around the house if anyone dies in the intervening time. Uh, Coconutella, I think you're part of the problem, you not having a career. But I can't give her a career, it'll contradict her existence. Let's try and get Coconutella to produce our next generation of servant. Um, what men does she get along with? She doesn't really know men outside of the house. She's just, uh, she's lived in seclusion. We've cloistered her in her little shack here. And, um, yeah, forbidden her from outside contact. Well, I'm going to send her out into the street to look for a man now. Look at that smoke over here. Something on fire. Or it could be just a dust storm or something. I think those things happen in deserts. Well, you have sand plus wind. It would be weird if they didn't happen. Uh, okay. First man to walk down the road is marrying Coconutella. Well, not marrying her. He's going to um, basically have his merry way with her and impregnate her with our heir. Not our heir to the to Ninja Manor. The heir to uh, the Coconut's Lodge back here. With their oh, it's still festive in here. I forgot about that. Yeah, we've got lots of decorations up still. Oh, here we go. Here's a man. Here is a man, and what a man. Look, he's already dressed like a butler. Perfect. He's He's got such an empty gaze and a strange stare. It's uh, King Mighty Charming. Okay, well, King Mighty Charming, you are about to have your uh, illegitimate son here. As all good kings do. Let, let's get this going. Why can I only introduce her? She's already introduced herself. Um, ask about his day. Yeah, tell him a joke about aliens. All the usual uh, sim sim conversations. We'll just get them going. Ask him to hang out as well. If, if he comes, if he hangs out here, then you know he'll be around a while. It's a good idea. Okay, Connor the Fourth, you should get your breakfast. There's no breakfast. Okay, you should make your breakfast. Have a quick meal. Have some cereal. Connor the Third. Oh, he should actually be making proper breakfast. I'm going to get him to go down and he can serve up some um, pancakes. We love pancakes here. I'll make sure Connor the fourth gets her cereal first. I don't want her waiting around. Oh, perfect. Uh, Mighty Charming is hanging around. Why don't you gossip with him? Who's this? Something Higgins. Um, she was moving too quickly. Oh crap, no, 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 no. I'm telling the wrong person to chat with uh, the prince. That's a disaster. Okay, 
Tell him a dramatic story, Coconutella. Oh, that, you're not Coconutella either. Why isn't Coconutella selecting? I, I'm left clicking. It's just, it's not happening. What if I right click on her? No. Oh, there we go. Okay. Tell him an engaging story. I think... I think she is telling him a story. I think she was selected. It just didn't update down here because you know it's such a robust game. I'm, I'm surprised to see an error like that. I've never seen a bug in The Sims Four before. Um, compliment his appearance. Here's our chance. Get in with some flirting. Uh, his appearance and impress him with video game prowess. Coconutella has been slacking off too much. I think that's all I'm learning from that social option. She's just been playing video games instead of cleaning the house. Oh, he's going for this. Um, I didn't think he would. Impress him with your video game prowess. He might like that. The pickup line. Oh, he, do he doesn't like that. Okay, that's maybe a little bit awkward. He doesn't like the video games. Oh, no, 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 no. This is going wrong. This is going wrong. Okay. Can we apologise or something? Ask him about his day. And express your admiration. There we go. Ah, oh, th it's getting better. We're, we're getting there. Get to know him. I, I don't know any of his traits. That's the problem. He's not a geek, obviously. Uh, pleasant conversation. Okay. And he's outgoing. Smooth recovery. Okay. Um, compliment his appearance. We're going to have to keep this flirting up now. They're friends. Oh my god. Oh no. He, he's he, he's not going for the flirting anymore. Um, can we smooth recovery him again? I think we're going to have to. I think he's probably just feeling very awkward at the moment. So why don't we bring him... Oh no, I got rid of that magic wine bottle. Uh, okay, I guess you're on your own. Coconutella. We can't use magic to influence him anymore. So, um, talk about handiness. We'll, we'll just keep it casual for a while. Uh, keep it friendly. Just get everyone back into the right kind of mindset, you know. Because he, he's not in a procreative mindset at the moment. And he's, he's not enjoying this conversation either. They're no longer friends. But he's feeling energised, so that's good. Okay, he's all uh, pumped up. Maybe that'll help. Maybe they can talk about fitness or they can work out together or something. Coconutella could probably use it. She's, um, she's been a bit lazy lately over the Christmas season. She hasn't done much. Oh, perhaps, uh, perhaps Uther could father her child. Look at him. No, no. She's she's made enough progress with the prince already. I mean, or the king. Sorry, he's a king. I have to remember that. He's not a prince, he's a king. He's been promoted. He m might have been a prince once. He is the uh, person formerly known as prince, but now known as king. Um, give an old heartfelt compliment there. And then maybe we can, we can get back into flirty territory. Oh, oh, now this is working. Okay. Um, flirt. Flirt. Um, okay, Connor the Fourth, what are you doing? Actually, you've got work soon. Um, maybe you should be in, you should play some chess and get focused because you've got work in two hours. Oh, only two hours. Ponder your moves, ponder your moves. Connor the Third, you should be practicing your storytelling. And Coconutella. Let's keep this going. This is her day off. I said I'd do that at one stage. Oh, he, he he's going for this flirting thing. Can we ask him if he's single or something? Or let's just embrace him. Oh, look, it's Ivo Robotnik. He's going to be in his Christmas clothes forever. Oh, Coconutella's gotten very flirty. Oh, no. No, don't hug him. You're, go you're going to get, like, pig poo all over his fancy suit. But... Where's he going? Come back here, Prince. Come back. Oh. He, he's not going for it anymore, I guess. Um, probably because Coconutella is covered in shit. So I'm going to go have her take a shower. Connor the Fourth, where are you going? Don't you have work? 
in 50 minutes. Okay, and she's going to observe the sky, which I guess will also get her focused. She'll be double focused. Oh no, the king had to leave. He, he had business elsewhere, I guess. Um, oh, and she's working on her logic skill at the same time. Oh no, she's tense because she's feeling trapped from her job. Oh no, no, don't go in in a bad mood. Oh crap, crap on a stick. Okay, she's got two hours of this and then one hour of focus at the end. Is, it, is her performance still going to improve? Yeah, okay, it's gradually improving. She's going to get her promotion anyway, I think. Um, Connor the third. How's this going? That's oh, going okay. He's uh, he's not in a confident mood, so he's not uh, gaining skills as fast as he could. But it he's making progress. Oh no, he's feeling tense. He has to do something fun as well. Um, I, I bet he's going to have to max out charisma for the next level of his career as well. So it's going to be a real pain in the hole. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get that point, get that point, and then you can take a break. I, th I can see his his brain, like his mental barriers breaking down. He's working too hard, but here we go. It's break time. Isn't that amazing? Oh no, the pancakes are not spoiled, are they? No, they've got two hours left. Stick them in the fridge. And someone just left these pancakes here. Excellent quality as well. Go eat those pancakes. I bet it was you. It wasn't Coco Nutella. She was outside. And it wasn't Connor the Fourth because she wouldn't waste food like that. It has to be Connor the Third. Coco Nutella. Don't waste your day off on video games. That's all she does. She just plays video games. She's not a. She doesn't have the geek trait or anything. She's just really into them. Um, I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. But let's let's get the king over again. Giving him a call while she's uh, doing a big shit. That's Coconutella all over. <laughs> I bet he can smell it through the phone. Oh, we also have to find Connor the Fourth's future husband. Hopefully some rich guy who can um, get some money back into this family. Okay, let's go out and have a deep conversation with this prince guy. Come on, Coconutella, you can do it. I keep calling him the prince guy, he's the king. I don't, I, well, I don't think he's the king. I think his name is King. Yeah, his name is King Mighty. It's like um, those websites where you can become a lord or whatever. And it's all fake. I mean, basically it, what they do is just change your name by deed poll. So that instead of being called Connor, I'd be called Lord Connor. That would just be my first name. It wouldn't actually be a title. It's a big scam thing. But people pay for it, I think. Um, or else it wouldn't be in business. So it's unusual. Let's see if he'll go for that hug now. Connor the Third, what are you doing? Playing video games. Okay, actually, that's quite good for his fun levels. But I want him to go and... Um, where's the internet? There we go. Oh, no, wait. Socialize. Go and go to the computer and chat with... Uh, Regan Caliente. Yeah, your daughter-in-law. You can be her friend. He needs friends. Um... Oh, let's see. How, how far can we go with this? Ask him if he's single, because I want to make sure. Then blow him a kiss. And then maybe, um... More choices. Hold his hands. Oh, he is single. Oh, wow. Well, maybe we could uh, marry him in here. No, I'm not going to marry him in. I don't need another person in the house. But, um... Yeah, this is going well. Okay, Let's have her have her first kiss at like thirty-seven years old, with King Mighty Charming. Well, at least it's a good one. She actually kissed him as well. There was no uh, hover lips here. That's good. Go go embrace him. Um, can they like have a baby yet? Okay, offer him a rose. He'll like that. And. In the rocket ship? Oh my god. Now, let's go try for a baby. Let's see where they do it. Now, I'm leaving it up to them. They've got freedom. Oh, are they going for... Oh, they're going for Coconutella's shack. I thought they might go for the rocket ship. But, uh, there we, there we go. 
Okay, well, that, that worked out. Um, let's do it one more time. Just, just to make sure. She hates children, though. Oh, I forgot about that. No one in this family likes children. Um, well, Connor the Fourth is non-committal. She's been promoted. Oh my God, to a command center lead. She's received eight hundred and sixty-nine simoleons and a Star Seeker original blueprints, and she can track satellites on her telescope. She needs to reach level three of fitness, and she needs to be energized going into work. Okay. Um, that's not too bad. Does she have any sleep replacement left? No, but can we afford some? Yes. Um, there we go. I don't know when she has work next, actually. 17 hours, yeah. So she's going to have to work through the night, I think. Let's just get her to drink down the sleep replacement. And uh, let's see. She also needs some food, so I'll get her to eat some pancakes. They're still in good condition, I think, because they're in the fridge. Uh, Coconutella has... Okay, she has hopefully procreated successfully. Go take your pregnancy test. I want to, I want to know. Hooray, Coconutella's pregnant. Okay, we've got our next generation coconuts on the way. So that's good. This is like a double legacy challenge, but it's like a poor people legacy and a rich people legacy in the same house. Although it's really a poor people legacy and a poor people legacy because we're really running out of money fast and we'll be bankrupt within just a matter of time. Oh, still tense from this career. That's not a, not a good thing. Um, okay, a brisk shower. That's what you need, Connor the Fourth. We need to get you energized for your workout at the gym. And then, uh, yeah, some treadmill time. Did you see that? She walked like naked through the kitchen to get to the gym. She just was so enthusiastic. She didn't even put her clothes back on until she was there. Now that's dedication. She is really into this career thing. Um, yeah, reach level three of the fitness skill. That's no problem at all. She's on career level four now. She'll be on five. Oh, look, Olive has come to visit her daughter. Sorry, Olive. Uh, kind of busy here in the middle of a big training regime. Oh my God, did she fall there? No, pace yourself, Connor the Fourth. Pace yourself. She's got a very hourglassy kind of shape, doesn't she? She's got like basically a really really big bottom and then she's quite thin above it push the limits go on oh my god we broke her she got frozen in time for a minute no she's doing okay she's pushing the limits of uh, human endurance hopefully this will get her her skill point um though i'm worried it won't i think she might actually just need to relax after this for a while i think it's going to come up just barely short of it Oh, or maybe not. Okay, I stand corrected. You can take a break now. She can now endurance run on the treadmill, and she can research workout tips on the computer. Wow. Okay. Why don't we get her to go and uh, channel surf for a while? Just get that fun level up. Uh, when is work? 12 hours. Okay, and she's got all the requirements. This will be fine. Connor the Third has two more days until work. He's in the wrong bed. You're in the wrong bed, Connor the Third. Because Coconutella is in the wrong bed. Oh my god. The family curse continues. Okay, Connor the Third, you go sleep in your bed. Coconutella, you can go sleep down here. Well, we know who's taking a swim after her baby comes along. I'm not going to drown a pregnant woman. I'm not a monster. Besides, we need it. We need a new servant. Actually, we'll probably have to keep her around to train uh, the new coconuts in. So, we'll see anyway. Oh, wow. Connor the Fourth is doing amazing. Um, I think she actually has time to work on her logic skill a little bit. So, why don't I get her to go up here and uh, play some chess with Olive? She's very happy. Look at her. She's just laughing her head off. She's having a brilliant time. Oh, here we go. Chess with a ghost. What a better way What better way to spend a Wednesday evening. How often does she have work, actually? Oh, she has quite frequently. Four days a week. That's, that's pretty good. Uh, we're going to get some money in from that. And astronauts pay well, I think. I think, yeah, I think maybe she could eventually support us. Oh, no, she's feeling confident instead of focused. This, uh, this isn't what I needed. Ponder your moves, quick. 
Ah, there we go. Okay, she's back in focus. Um, 